how to create a coupon on your stripe account hey everyone welcome i hope you're all doing great in this video i'll show you step by step how to actually create discounts or coupons on stripe now for me i'm going to be doing all of this in test mode but for you it's going to go, it's not going to be in test mode and it's going to work exactly the same way so don't worry about that anyways so let's just go ahead and get started on how to create a coupon first you will need to just go to the products uh, section on stripe so you will need to go to the left panel and find product catalog and here you will find obviously all the products that you have already launched uh, and they're going to be in here um, and we want to just go to the top uh, navigation bar here and you will find coupons as the third option it may be different for you but it should you know include the coupons option so just go ahead and click on that and then from here we have the no test coupons or no coupons for you so obviously we want to create a new one so feel free to just click on create a coupon now for me again it's a test coupon but it's going to be the same thing so click on create a coupon here and we can just go ahead and get started so the first thing is going to be a name uh, and w this is just going to be something that uh, you will need to give a name to and it is actually going to appear to customers receipts and invoices so make sure it's a proper name uh, for me obviously i'm just going to name it test coupon and then we can just go ahead and give it an id if you want to but i'm just going to leave it empty because it is optional now if you know what you're doing with the id and stuff if you want to add one you have the option to do so now the type is going to be whether it's going to be a percentage discount so a specific percentage off or fixed uh, amount discount so if it's a fixed amount you would want to add the discount amount if it is a percentage you also want to add that in here i'm just going to stick with the percentage and i'm just going to type in 15 percent off and then you want to click on apply to specific products if not then it is actually going to apply to all products and you know i don't think you actually want that unless you do then you just keep it empty but if you want to apply to specific products you can just go ahead and click on that and then now uh, you would want to basically select the product that you want to apply to i only have this one so i'm just going to select it if you have a multiple you can just feel free to choose them and you can also add another product to um have that included in and then we have the duration so if you actually want to set up an end time for it you can feel free to do so so once uh, and then we can just go ahead and leave that there and then uh, again i'm just going to leave, actually leave it forever uh, and then here we have the redemption limits so limit the, the date range when customers can redeem this coupon this is actually where you set up the end time it's not going to be in the duration this is going to be how many times people will be able to redeem it so here we can actually set up the end time so if you want to end uh, the, the coupon at a specific date you can feel free to do so i'm not going to do so and then because you can feel free to delete it whenever you actually want if you want but this is going to just make it automated if you know what i mean and you also limit you can also limit the total number of times this coupon can be redeemed so this is going to be the entire uh, entirety of it so let's say you only want to have uh, 15 coupons and that's it so you can just feel free to do so i'm just again not going to do so and then i'm just going to click on create coupon and we are pretty much set you can actually see that we have this one right here uh, test coupon and it is pretty much working for that specific product that we have uh, added and if you want you can feel free to always just go ahead and uh, delete the coupon if you don't want it to apply it anymore so this is pretty much all there is to know for this topic. So hopefully you found this video to be informative and thanks for watching.